Hi guys, this is Varun from uh, DenShare.com. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be telling you to how, how to uh, you know set name servers on your domain name from your current hosting provider. So uh, let's just begin. Uh, okay, I'm gonna, I'm just going to log out from this. I'm going to take you from the start so there's no confusion. Now, supposingly you have a domain name that you purchased and you've also got. Uh, uh, you know the hosting uh, plan from one of the hosting service provider. Now I've got same the hosting and the domain from Big Rock. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna log into uh, my account first. So this is one second. Let's go to the main page of Big Rock, and okay, I'm gonna log out. Log in with a different account altogether. For some reason, it's not logging out. Let's just try again. Okay, here we go. It worked again. Now it then. Okay, let me check. I'm gonna cross everything. This is not my account. This is not you. Delete cookie. Okay, now it says hello. Might be a glitch. Okay, so let's go to my account. I've recently purchased this uh, well absurd domain. And just to let you know, guys, it's just the test domain uh, by the name of absurdnews.in. So let me just log in. Okay. Now the problem is uh, both the emails are different. Now I've got the absurd news. Uh, you know dashboard logged in on P uh, Big Rock. Now this is the place where I have to specify the name servers. Now currently it has my old old uh, name servers from HostGator from which I had a subscription earlier but I changed it to Big Rock uh, considering the good amount of discount that these guys gave so I'm just gonna leave them blank for here and update name server. Oh okay I need to at least uh, do one so I'm just gonna cancel it for a time being. Now, what I want to do is I have already got my name so it was written down somewhere, but I couldn't find it. So I'm I'm gonna have to log out again. I'm gonna sign out from absurdnews.in, and uh, let's see if I can log in with my new credential, which is not apparently showing. So let's just go to Big Rock once again. Okay, now this is not my account. Let's just log out. Oh, I don't know why it's happening. It's like okay. okay. Let's just delete the cookies. I do a control and an F5, and then I try again logging out from this. Okay, now it's gone. Probably because of uh, my saved password. So I go into my account. The first thing that I need to do is I need to get hold of my name servers. So share.com that's newly uh, domain purchase that I have and I have an account with the name of denshare.denshare at the gmail.com on Bay Rock. It's gonna take me to the dashboard first of all. Okay, so here's my domain which I've purchased and uh, uh, here's the multi domain Linux hosting plan that I've, uh, the USA hosting that I've brought recently. So Let's just go into the domain hosting details. Okay, name server details. Let me see. Okay, these are the two name servers that we have. So I'm just gonna like copy it into a notepad. And the second one, you need to specify both of them. Uh, single one would not work. So just cross it. And now again, we have to do this tiresome task of logging out, sign out, and go to big rock dot in. Okay. Well, big rock has this issue now. I need to report this. Okay, I do the control F5 again, and this time I think it will be able to log me out. 
Oh, great, I'm logged out. Let's go to my account once again. And now I go to absurdnews.in where my domain is. Okay, let's cross this YouTube button. Not helping. Okay, there we go. So I just click on absurd news. It's got the back panel for me and what I need to do is I need to define the name service for absurd news. So let's just take the new ones. These are the new ones from uh, the big rock. I had the host get a one so I just need to change it. If it's a new domain altogether. Okay, and I do a name update name service. The name servers have been successfully updated. Okay. So this is how you do it. Now most of the companies uh, tell you that it takes about 24 to 48 hours for the domain to get propagated on the new name service. But I would recommend you to keep on checking this after a couple of hours, every couple of hours, because it doesn't take that long. It doesn't take about 24 to 48 hours. That's the maximum time frame that these guys give. All right. So we've successfully specified name server. Let's just wait for a while. And in my next video, I'm going to tell you how to install WordPress after your domain has been fully propagated uh, into your new hosting server. Alright, so I'm going to take a time out till the next video. You guys have a nice one and uh, keep on watching more video tutorials for more Word and more WordPress articles on Denshare.com.